All right, what's going on YouTube? I am here with, what's your name? Steve Cervera. Steven Cervera, he won the Attack of the Giant card in day one. Um, tell me about yourself, buddy. Where are you from? Uh, I'm from Arizona. Arizona? You have any premier tops or anything like that? Uh, I've topped a few regionals back in the day. Uh, nothing really recent. I've been more in the vending game. Yep, yep. Your local local vendor out here doing big stuff with little cards. True. All right, so what did you play? I played True Draco. All right, and uh, what were your matchups? Um, Round one? What was round one? I'm like really forgetful about shit. Dude, what, what, what? Lightsword? Yeah. Oh yeah, Lightsword. I played a 60 card Lightsword Dino deck. Uh, game, or uh, round two, I played his uh, friend playing the same exact deck. So uh, I 2 won him, I 2 0 his friend. I played one of my friends from Vegas round three who was playing Magicians. Yep. My deck's literally beat, built, built to beat Magicians. Yeah. Um, round four, I faced a mirror match and he, he just bricked. I, I 2 I two him, flapped him like 10 minutes. Yeah. And then uh, round five, uh, yeah, I, I, drew, I drew the nuts, so. Yeah, yeah, I saw. All right, let's get into the deck. Sure, um, you know, it's just a standard Draco deck. Um, play three masterpiece. Uh, this card's busted. Yeah. Um, literally unaffected by. Anything, why, do you play, anything you why do you play three instead of two? Um, because you don't have dynamite anymore. Yeah. So when you did have dynamite, you only want to play two because it, it would be a break at that point. But uh, with dynamite gone, um, Ignis isn't really that good, and Majesty Maiden isn't really that good either. So you want to see this as much as possible. This is your boss. Um, I played three of the rock. I'm gonna lot of, I, don't, I don't know what people call it. Uh, it's busted. Card's uh, great. I love going second. So if my opponent wins the dice roll, I'm like yes. Yeah. If I win, I hate I hate to let them go first because then they know what I'm playing. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, I played two Majesty Maiden. Um, you want to search out the masterpiece. You want to get that out as fast as possible. That's fair. And then I play one Ignis. Uh, search the spell cards. Spell cards are good. Uh, that's it for monsters. I play nine monsters. Um, nine monsters. Yeah. Play play demise. So you don't really want to draw too many. Yeah. So uh, now to the spells. Uh, three card demise. Yeah. Like I just explained. Yeah. <laughs> Cards busted. Um, Self-explanatory. I love having Amanawada and demise because you don't have to discard it at end turn. So yeah. it's good. Uh, three disciples. Um, Self-explanatory. Three yeah. heritage. Self-explanatory. I mean, if, if you're not playing those and you're playing True Draco, you're bad. Right. <laughs> um, three Pot of Duality. Again, self-explanatory. You're playing Dracos. You, you know you're playing this card. Um, three Diagram. Again. Yep. Um, you, you need to search stuff. And also, it helps It helps with Demise Hands, too. Yep. Because if you Demise and you draw like into an Ash or you draw into like a second monster or something, yeah. it just helps you get rid of that card. Absolutely. Uh, play Two Desires. Uh, reason I didn't play three, I'm only playing a 41 card deck, yeah. 41 main, so I don't really want to see this more than once. Yeah, absolutely. I agree with that. And then two terraforming. Why um, not three? Re there's really no room in the deck. Like the, the list I made, um, there, there's really no room in here yeah. at all. I, I didn't want to play 42 because I wasn't playing upstart. Okay, that sounds uh, good. Uh, that's it for spells, uh, if that wasn't enough. No, yeah. Play uh, three true Draco Apocalypse. Okay. Self explanatory. Yeah. Uh, cards busted. Uh, half your opponent's uh, monsters. Did you end up using the uh, the halfing a lot? I tried to use it once and it got negated. Oh. But I still was able to destroy a monster because it was negated and destroyed. So. Yeah. Uh, three Monarchs Erupt. This is a new card people have been playing. Yeah. And it is basically a lasting skill drain. Yeah. So if they destroy your tribute summon monster, it still lingers on the board for a turn. So you have another chance to uh, tribute summon a monster and keep oh, it on board. That is really good. And why don't you? Why do you play three and not two? A lot of decks play two. It, it, it's bust. I want to see this card every game. Yeah. I, I don't. I don't want to miss a chance at having or not having this card. That's really good. Uh, I play two rivalry of warlords. How was that today? It was amazing. That is the spice. I've um, seen that been played a lot today. Like I said, my first two rounds were Lights for Dino. Yeah. So I absolutely activate this, not. they can't do anything. <laughs> yeah. Pendulums yeah, can't do anything. Yeah. The only uh, the only deck I signed this out against was uh, my mirror match. So it was just for it, pendulums. It, it, it was for pendulums, and for some reason, two people were playing Lights for Dinos. So yeah. it, it really worked against that too. Um, basically, any deck that plays more than one archetype. Yeah. Um, one Imperial Order, uh, if I could play three, I would. Yeah, that card's really good. The card's really, really good. Uh, one True King's Return, um, I would play more if I could. And then, uh, 
One solemn judgment, one solemn warning. Is Again, it the only the only solemns that you played? Yes. No strikes. I don't play strikes. Uh, in, in my opinion, in this deck, uh, like I said, there's no room either. Yeah. But solemn strikes bad. Yeah. Like especially against pendulums. They, they'll just get their effects again. Yep. Like Black Fang, Purple Poison, everything is just going to get their effect again. So what's the point of playing that? Like, this on a Pendulum Summon is busted. Oh, yeah. All their shit goes to Grave. They, they lose. Clutch. And then my final card, Skill Drain. Yep. Another Monarchs are up, basically. Mm, amazing card. Uh, 40, and it's Ultra. Uh, it's Ultra, of course. You got to play the Spice. Uh, this was MRD first, but it was damaged, and I was suggested to take it out. Oh. So I had to play the shitty Ghost Rare. Um... <laughs> The deck is really good, uh, 41 cards. Um, I wouldn't change anything in the main deck in all honesty. No? Uh, it worked out really well. I didn't break any game. That's good. Um, you know, there were some hands where it was like, eh, this hand could be a little bit better, but there was never a game where it was like, oh my God, this hand is fucking trash. I need to change it. Yeah. Um, and then we'll go into the side deck. I don't play an extra deck because true Dracos. Yeah. Um, my tokens, Black Goku, the Those Joker. Got him in a collection. Pretty nice. Um, all right. So, you got three Ash Blossoms. Uh, self explanatory, in my opinion. Yeah. If you're not playing this card this format, you're trash. <laughs> yeah. um, so, Either in the side or the main. Yeah. yeah. One, of, one of the two. You need to be playing this card. There's so many decks now. Like, Pendulum isn't the only deck anymore. Yep. Everybody is playing something random or rogue. Rogue is very, very good. Th this card breaks rogue, yep. it destroys them. So, it's really bad not to play it. Um, three Danko Sekas. Very interesting. Um, I, I don't like Paleo. Right. And the, I, I don't know if this deck loses heart to Paleo or not. I really haven't had much testing with it. Sure. But I don't want to find out. Right. I, I'd rather just have a Danko for it. Play the Danko and move yeah. on with our lives. Exactly. Uh, one Monster Reborn. Play three if I could. Card unfair. Yeah, you just couldn't fit it in the main? Uh, no. There, there's yeah. too tight. No room. Um, two Cosmic Cyclones, Pendulums. Um, and mirror match? Yeah, and mirror match. Because you remove the diagram, you remove their spells and traps. No effects. You know, it's yeah. busted. Um, three anti-spell. Again, pendulums, mirror match. So you opted to go first in games two and three, depending on... D depending on what I'm playing. You know, like Lightsworn Dido, I let them go first. Yeah. Because all I summon is Amino Wado. They can't do anything. Yeah. Against pendulums, you always opt to go first? When you're um, running, obviously. If I win game one, I let... Uh, or no, they they usually let me go first. Yeah. But if I lose game one against Pendulums, I usually go first. Yeah. Yeah. Because I, I wanna set, I wanna, I wanna activate this. Yeah. I also play a two D barrier. Um, same thing. You know, I side these in. Uh, I don't side Ashes. I was, it's bad against Pendulum. Yep. Um, I, I know a lot of people think it's good. It, it's not. No, they play through it too easily. The, yeah. Ash literally stops one thing, and they're like, "Cool, I'm gonna keep going anyway." <laughs> yeah. Um, and then one evenly matched. Just uh, one. I, I didn't really think about it too much. I literally put the side deck together uh, 30 minutes before the event started. Yeah. So, um, I like if I could find another D barrier, I, I probably would have played three of these. Um, th this card's not that good match. in my opinion. Not even the mirror match. No. It. I, I mean, even in the mirror match, like they maybe have like five cards. It, yeah. You know, True Draco doesn't really have too many cards on the field or in their hand. So, yeah. it, it's not that good in my opinion. All right, you got any shout outs? Um, yeah, shout outs to uh, Proplay Games, uh, George Machado. Um, you know, gives me cards, gives me mats, gives me clothes. I like him. <laughs> um, shout outs to basically every popular person. <laughs> I know that sounds like really conceited. Uh, Michael State, uh, Blair Hunter, you know, basically all the boys the out here. Yeah. Um, you know, they gave me some encouragement and uh, yeah, I decided very, to play. You're very well known in the Yu Gi Oh community. I, I don't know, I guess. Yeah. People know me. Yeah. <laughs> or they know of me, at least. Yep. Um, I don't know, that's it. Yeah. Oh, shout I out agree. to Arizona, too. Uh, Shogun's Dojo. You know, if you don't know what that is, it sucks, but. You know. <laughs> is that a local card shop? Uh, local card shop, Top Caliber Gaming. Uh, Johnny Bircher, he's the owner. Oh, sweet. All right, man. Good job today. Thanks for your time. Thanks. And uh, we'll see you next time. All right.